मेडिसिन वेलकम टू डॉक्टर मेडिसिन आई एम डॉक्टर रोबोट टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द प्रोटीन कैलोरी माल न्यूट्रिशन बिफोर एंटरिंग टू द टॉपिक वी शुड नो व्हाट इज माल न्यूट्रिशन अकॉर्डिंग टू द वर्ल्ड हेल्थ ऑर्गेनाइजेशन माल न्यूट्रिशन इज डिफाइंड एज द सेलुलर इंबैलेंस बिटवीन द सप्लाई ऑफ न्यूट्रिएंट्स एंड एनर्जी एंड द बॉडीज डिमांड फॉर देम टू एंश्योर ग्रोथ मेंटेनेंस एंड स्पेसिफिक फंक्शंस द प्रोटीन कैलोरी माल न्यूट्रिशन The protein calorie malnutrition is also referred to as protein energy malnutrition. It is considered as the primary nutritional problem in India, also called the first national nutritional disorder. The term PEM applies to a group of related disorders that include marasmus, quashiorga and intermediate stages. Epidemiology. The protein energy malnutrition causes 0.46% of all death worldwide. and an average of 42 death per million people in a year etiology many factors can lead to protein energy malnutrition in children they are social and economic factors biological factors environmental factors role of free radicals and age of the host among these the most common causes are lack of breastfeeding and giving diluted formula overcrowding in family ignorance illiteracy lack of health education poverty infections familial disharmony and free radical damage and aflatoxin poisoning the protein calorie malnutrition occurs frequently in infants and young in children whose rapid growth increases the nutritional requirements classification the clinical presentation depends upon the type severity and duration of the dietary deficiencies the most common forms of protein energy malnutrition are marasmus quashiorga nutritional dwarfing and overweight of children of these four types marasmus and quashiorga are the most common forms in today's video we will discuss about marasmus the term marasmus is derived from the greek word marasmos which means withering or wasting marasmus is a form of severe protein energy malnutrition characterized by energy deficiency marasmus is characterized by stunted growth and wasting of muscle and tissue marasmus usually develops between an age of 6 month to 1 year in children who have been weaned from breast milk or who suffer from weakening conditions like chronic diarrhea pathophysiology of marasmus the inadequate intake of carbohydrate lead to reduced available nutrient to the body tissue this state of affair make the body to start adjusting metabolically and in terms of hormone secretion in that way the production of thyroxine is decreased in order to reduce the metabolic rate so that less energy is required The production of insulin reduces to try and maintain the blood sugar level. As a result, the growth is suspended. This accounts for the retardation that is seen in malnourished child. To meet the body's energy demand, the body starts to break down the fat and muscle tissue to generate energy so that the essential metabolic activities are kept going despite the inadequate carbohydrate intake. This accounts for the severe wasting seen in marasmic child. The body literally digests itself. to maintain the serum level as a result there is progressive loss of fat and muscle tissue as well as depletion of electrolytes therefore the child appears emaciated the most common symptoms of marasmus include sunken eyes thin and bony face ribs clearly visible through the skin and poor growth treatment of marasmus the best way to treat marasmus is to give the affected individual a healthy diet which is rich in protein and calorie There are specific method of refeeding and rehydrating the affected individual so as to prevent complication. The method generally used for refeeding are use of intravenous fluids, rehydration solutions administered orally and feeding through NG tubes. Okay guys, it's time to wind up. Let's discuss about Kashyorkar in our next video. Thank you for watching.